Hello friends. In this lesson, I am going to discuss about narration changes. It's only for practice lesson for the students of class 9 and 10 under West Bengal Board of Secondary Education. In my earlier classes, I have already discussed the basic rules for changing narration from direct to indirect and indirect to direct. You please go through the same first for knowing the basic. Here, I am giving you the lesson only for practice purpose. Unless you know the basic, you will not understand this lesson. So let's start. Narration change when reporting verb is in present or future tense. That means the reporting verb, if the reporting verb is in present or in future, then there should not be any changes from direct to indirect in respect of tense. So, let me tell you. Number one, Amina says, I am happy. It's in direct speech. In indirect speech, it will be, Amina says that she is happy. For your information, I am telling you, all are in direct to indirect. So, I will not repeat again. Number two, Suhana will say, I sang a Hindi song. The answer will be, Suhana will say that she sang a Hindi song. Number three, you say to me, you know me. The answer will be, you tell me that I know you. Number four, she will say, I was watching TV. The answer will be, she will say that she was watching TV. Number five, Santos will say, I have planted the tree. The answer will be, Santos will say that he has planted the tree. Number six, Disha says, I was busy. The answer will be, Disha says that she was busy. Number seven, Paulomi says, I am fine. The answer will be, Paulomi says that she is fine. Number eight, he says, let you be successful in life. The answer will be, he wishes that he may be successful in life. Number nine, he keeps saying, I am ruined. The answer will be, he keeps saying that he is ruined. Number 10, Selim says to Onil, I will go with you. The answer will be Selim tells Onil that he will go with him. Next, narration change when reporting verb is in past tense. That means if the reporting verb is in past tense, when you are going to change the narration from direct to indirect, the tense will be changed. So, please listen to me. Number one, Osim said, I know the fact. Here, not say. Said, that means reporting verb is in past. So, Osim said, I know the fact. The answer will be in indirect speech. Osim said that he knew the fact. So, in this way, all are in Direct to indirect. So, I will not repeat again. Number two, he said to me, I have seen your pet. The answer will be, he told me that he had seen my pet. Number three, you said to her, I met you here yesterday. Answer will be, you told her that you had met her there the previous day. Number four, he said, now I am taking rest. The answer will be, he said that. Then he was taking rest. Number five, Santos said, 
I was playing badminton with my brother. Answer will be Santos said that he had been playing badminton with his brother. Number six. You said to me, you will give me these papers tomorrow. Answer will be, you told me that I would give you those papers the next day. Number seven. Anu said to Imon, only you can help me today. The answer will be Onus told Imon that only he could help him that day. Number eight. My brother said to me, I have done it. Answer will be my brother told me that he had done it. Number nine. She said to me, I can help. I can help you. The answer will be she told me that she could help me. Number 10. We said to our teacher, we shall obey you. The answer will be, we told our teacher that we would obey him. Next, narration change of the interrogative sentence. That means questioning sentence. Number 1. I said to her, where do you live? All are from direct to indirect. I said to her, where do you live? The answer will be, I asked her where she lived. Number two, she said to Debu, are you well? Answer will be, he asked Debu if he was well. Number three, I said to him, what is your profession? The answer will be, I asked him, what his profession was. Number four, my uncle said to me, how was your performance yesterday? The answer will be, my uncle asked me how my performance was the previous day. Number five, number five, Santo said to her, what did you expect of me? Answer will be, Santos asked her, what she had expected of him. Number six, you said to him, when will you start the business? The answer will be, you asked him when he would start the business. Number seven, Rick said to her, why did you say this yesterday? The answer will be, Rick asked her why she had said that the previous day. Number eight, the teacher said to the students, who taught you English? The answer will be the teacher asked the students who had taught them English. Number nine, the doctor said to the patient, what do you take in your breakfast? The answer will be the doctor asked the patient what he took, what he took in his breakfast. Number 10. I said to her, what is your hobby? The answer will be, I asked her what her hobby was. So guys, these are some examples only for your practice purpose. I hope it's clear to you. Thanks for listening to me. Tata, see you again.